Specialist insurer NTI needed to launch a new brand, Marine Protect, into the marine insurance market, the world's oldest insurance category. Backed by big players, NTI wanted Marine Protect to stake its claim as market leader from day one. While ships and cargo travel the world, our primary target audience was key decision makers in 40 companies in the Australian marine insurance market. This gave us the chance to make a big impact with a tailored communications piece. Our idea was to send a unique book resembling a 400-year-old ship's hull. It was bound by mooring rope, dipped in tar. On the cover of the book was nailed a 17th century Spanish coin, also known as a piece of eight. These particular pieces had been on a Portuguese ship named the São José W. Until their recovery by marine archaeologists, they had sat on the bottom of the Mozambique Strait off Africa since 1622. The journey of these coins had indeed resumed and given the new Marine Protect brand instant heritage, gravity and purpose. On the following pages, Marine Protect's philosophies and products are introduced, all the while keeping a modern tone. With the famous sea poem Sea Fever by John Macefield running as an element throughout, the verses were typeset and data projected onto muslin cloth, photographed and incorporated into the design. The design team also photographed headlines underwater for an authentic look and feel. For additional impact, the agency included three 1.5 metre wide gatefold spreads. We also used an image from Breaking News, contacting the Sydney Harbour ferry worker who took this pic on the Manly Ferry. We added it to the design only days before offset printing started. The book finishes with a certificate of authenticity for the piece of eight in a die-cut slit in the back. These unique books certainly got the attention of their niche target audience, as did the rest of the launch campaign.